Hey guys, Matt from Adventure Sport. I just wanted to do a quick video about how to disassemble a Surefire tail switch. This happens to be a Z41, I believe. Um, it's a it's a twisty on-off switch, and it's got like a momentary action on it. Uh, but most people typically prefer a clicky. And when you get into really really high current type bulbs, like uh, my XHP70 bulbs, for example, or some of the other uh, triples and quads that are on the market. Um, it's pretty hard to find a, a clicky switch that can handle that current. Um, there are a couple of aftermarket sellers. Um, Torch Lab, I believe, is one of them, and also Dell Superman makes a high current clicky. And I wanted to just show you how to how to install this stuff. This particular one is made by Dell Superman, and it's a based on a Judco switch, which I really like. I think these are great switches. I mean, they're very robust, and I, I mean, you can, I can tell he's got a lot of work into those, and he sells those, I've seen on Candle Power for him, and these belong to a customer. I had some other stuff I was doing for him, so he sent these along for me to install. But anyway, basically, you just have to get in here and, of course, pull that spring out, um, and I'm going to do two because they're a little bit different. Um, if you've got that rounded head stud in there and there's no uh, there's no hex key thing available, you just all you have to do is grab a hold of this thing and pull it out of there because it's like I don't know what they call that, but it isn't a it's not a screw. I mean, you can see it's got some really aggressive. Uh, swirls on there a pressure stud or something I think maybe and once you've freed that there's another piece that down in there holds the switch boot in place and so you can just take your needle nose pliers and spin that out of there And that last piece of that, you don't need any of this for that. And then these, this particular one just turns right in, and then you've got a very high current clicky. I did try this with one of my uh, bulbs, and it, it performs really well. I'm impressed. I thought that was, uh, as far as I know, that's the best uh, clicky that you can get for a surefire right now. Now, we're going to do this uh, this one had a spring but I've already got that pulled out of there and on this one you can see that instead of that rounded over pressure stud it's actually got a hex key thing and you you can't just spin this out of there like that and I also tried grabbing a hold of this and and twirling it but that that doesn't do it either that's not what that's screwed into it's not this piece that it's screwed into um, it's a piece down here, and you might be able to push really hard on this and get enough tension to, to loosen that, but this one was pretty dang stuck, so I what I did to get in there is I just peeled that out of there. you got to be careful not to shred that boot, but then you've got something that you can bite on right there and stick your... Allen head. This is a 330 seconds Allen wrench there. And then it'll just spin free. And then the same thing, you just remove that to get your boot out. Anyway, I just thought I'd show that real quick. Uh, happy modding.